like, you know, I was joking how everybody's make sure you take it all in. And I'm like, you know, I can't take it all in. I'm not sailing. But I kind of was able to because right in front of me, it just said Fenway Park. And then I had all of these memories and I would be looking around going like I saw a father and son get into a fight right there. One of the funniest things I ever saw in my life. Um, it was this, this dude, I don't know, his son had some sort of issue. Um, like, I don't know what. Um, he, kid wasn't drinking. He had some sort of mental issue going on and he was a big kid. And he was getting all amped up and his dad was telling him to calm down. And it was just like... And the kid just had enough of his dad and they just fucking went. <laughs> and the kid connected first and then the dad threw a fucking really tight, efficient fucking body shot, which I thought came from a place of love. He didn't headhunt. He fucking hit him in the side. This was the 80s. All right. There wasn't a lot of help for parents stressed out with some six foot four kid that was, you know, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I still to this day don't know what the issue was. Something going on there. So you, I don't know. It was like funny. Just, I don't know why it was funny. It was just funny. Cause it was like fucking sad. And, and, and the dad did what he had to do. And he fucking stopped it because it was getting scary. Cause he didn't know what was going to happen. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? I look, I don't, I don't, I just, it's something I saw. So I was thinking about that. And then I looked in the upper deck and it's like, that's the time I was drinking. And uh, I literally blacked out for three innings. And when I came to my shirt, I just had mustard all over it because I'd eaten a hot dog. And when I came around, like people was, I could just sense people sort of, looking at me in the side of their eye. And so I just started talking to people, you know, to let them know I was back. And I could just tell the way that they were looking at me, like some, I did something fucked up. Probably just them watching me eating the hot dog. Like, I, I mean, mustard was all over my fucking shirt. Like I used it as a napkin or something. I don't know what, I remember I was wearing a blue Michigan Wolverine t-shirt and it said Michigan in yellow. And then I just had mustard all over the fucking thing. Um, when I looked along the first baseline, I was thinking like that's where I went in 1986 when Roger Clemens was, I believe, having his first Cy Young uh, season. And he'd already established himself as this up-and-coming power pitcher 